In today's FX markets, let's take a look at the Australian dollar as it's experiencing some selling pressure today. The Australian dollar is coming off of five consecutive higher closes before giving back a little bit of ground today. Currently down a little over half a percent, right around the zero spot six seven level as the markets are reacting to a couple of different data points uh, in the last couple of days, as well as uh, some price action in the U.S. dollar finding a temporary bottom. And those are the driving factors as to why I think we're seeing a little bit of downside here for the Australian dollar today. Now, when you look at economic data, China continues to show signs of struggling. Uh, economic activity continues to languish. And proximity to China, as well as Japan, is uh, having an impact on the Australian dollar, I think. Couple that with uh, data points. We did have uh, weekly jobless claims, which uh, came in a little bit below expectations. And that created a little bit of selling pressure in the treasury markets, which also created some buying pressure in the U.S. dollar, as the dollar is coming off of basically uh, the low, lo lowest levels for the year. And that's also creating uh, some headwinds for the Australian dollar today. Now, when you look at the general trends, the Australian dollar is coming off a of better than one month high yesterday. So we are coming off of some of the highest levels in just over a month before giving back a little bit of ground today. And we look at most of the major FX markets, really the two weakest uh, markets in the FX space today showing the weakest relative strength is the Australian dollar and the Japanese yen, both under some pressure today. We're seeing some uh, weakness in the euro, but not as much as uh, the Australian dollar. And actually, the British pound is actually slightly higher today. So a little bit of a mixed bag when you look at the price action in the FX futures markets. But today, when you look at relative strength, Australian dollar realizing some of the heaviest selling pressure coming off a one-month high.